Hello everyone, this is Direwolf20 and Pahimar. It's Hello. episode 32 of the Agrarian Sky series. Wow, and we're like coming up, it feels like we're close to the end, but you never know. With Jaded, there could be some sneaky stuff around the corner. Oh yeah, um, oh yeah. So I'm working on the Ruin of the Orb and Ruin of Dislocation. That's what I'm working on crafting right at the moment. I am working on this botany and biology, and I feel like very feel shortly like... I'll be into the botany side of things. Because I have all yeah. the combs. Actually, you know what? Let me hand them in. Let me get them. Where is my master blood orb? I think I left it down in my alchemy area. All right, I got 64 melacomb, 64 certus comb, 64 energetic comb, and my essence of a shallow grave. Sweet. So let's hand that in. Yeah, and there's... Oh. More to oh, it? Yeah, a banana tree, and this looks like it's... <laughs> this is a quest that's designed for me, apparently, because in agrarian skies, I am known as the grumpy one. Really? Yep. I need to make a banana tree. Which one trees. is this now? Is this bees and trees? Uh, yeah, botany and biology. The banana tree has in recent times become sacred to the grumpy one. No one is quite sure why, but he seems to live within a great golden banana. Maybe a tribute of bananas will appease him and grant you a reward. And they spelled bananas wrong. <laughs> I have no idea how to make a banana. <laughs> Looks like you've got some work to do. I do. But I did some other quests to hand in. Oh... Well, at the end of last episode, I was working on two in the bragging rates. So mm -hmm. I did the thermal expansion and the vanilla lover quests. And that's uh, oh, bragging uh... rights, so we can hand those in. All right, one sec. I'm about to make rune of dislocation, I think, is the next one I need. That might need... Well, I have to use the master. Hold on. I think it's down in my alchemy area. And then we can hand it in, I promise, Bahamar. Bahamar's like, I did all this work, I just want to hand it in. And Direwolf's like, I've already yeah. handed it in. Oh, okay. That's fair enough. I'm just waiting on you so I can open the bags. Okay. Alright, so which ones are these now? Um, bragging rights, thermal expansion, and vanilla. Oh, so nice. I got two epic, so I got two bags. epic bags. The first one has a whole bunch of wood. Wow, there was a lot of stuff you had to make. And the second one was 16 gas tiers. Okay. Yeah, that third well, one had a lot. Bags. I've got some signs. You want my green heart canister? You can have it, because I'm full on health. Or whatever. Kay. I got a very nice reward, precision shears that don't have a texture. Well, they do in my inventory. They just didn't on the. Yeah, oh, I got that too. but in the nice reward, I got some Ender Lily seeds. So let's see. I needed to do blood magic. I'm gonna submit that, and I guess we can claim the reward for blood magic. I'll take your green hearts canister. Uh, out of my bag, uh, I got bag. 16 storage buses, 16 precision precision import. 16 precision out export and 16 cable. Nice. I'm apparently a vanilla weirdo. Boy, there's a lot of things you need to craft for these just weirdo quests at the end there. Um, cool. Now, you wanted me to start working on this five star chef thing because you're like, I did all the cooking and I want Direwolf to cook now? Oh, yeah. Is that because these are going to be really hard? I have no idea. I haven't looked up the recipe. So since I did the majority of the meal. cooking quests, uh, I want uh, Direwolf to make 64 delighted meals and 64 supreme pizzas. I need a deluxe cheeseburger and fries or zucchini fries. Did Sounds we like, do anything with zucchini? Like, nope, and we did nothing with potatoes. But you have these two yeah, lovely these farms two lo here. And you also have okay. this uh, autonomous activator set up that you can use with bone meal. We have a lot of salt, so I don't have to worry about that. Yeah. Thankfully, uh, because of the sludge boilers over here, that's what's been giving us salt all this time. I know, which is awesome. So fries shouldn't be a problem with potatoes, but I need a deluxe cheeseburger, which requires lettuce and tomato. How are we for lettuce and tomato? Are we still, like, awesome on that amount of stuff? Uh, we probably don't have a lot of tomato or lettuce. 
But once again, lettuce. Yeah. I think we have enough lettuce because I only need a, I only need a stack of it. I don't need like a bajillion. Oh yeah, and there's sixteen thousand tomato, so you're good. Sweet. You're probably gonna need like um, beef like... and like pork and stuff. So for a deluxe cheeseburger, I need a cheeseburger. So I need cheese, which is obviously we have a lot of that, right? I think our A system even knows how to craft it. And then I can do raw beef or firm tofu or, yeah, raw beef. And we have enough of that, too. So I think I really only have to get potatoes going. How do I make bananas? Dude, we even have, like, plenty of potatoes. I can probably just do this right now. Well, you do that. Um, I need to find out how we get bananas. Jaded, you really stumped me with this one. Oh, we have a banana sap. So the other thing I need to make is a supreme pizza. For a supreme pizza, I need cutting board, which is probably not a problem. Pizza, we onion, bell pepper, and spice leaf. We Onions, have a cutting board from early on. Bell pepper? I don't have bell peppers, but I have bell pepper seeds. And we're good on spice leaves as well. What are these, soybean crops that you're planting here? That's what I had been doing, because uh, I didn't want to make fish. Right. Let me see how Pa and Mar's little system here works, and if it's any good. I see how you have that set up. Okay, so that's cool. So you're cool with me chopping down the tofu thing? Oh, you are welcome to it. Nice. Man, I wonder if I need that. You know what? Do you want to cut back in a few minutes since I figured out how to make a banana sapling? Sure. Since you're just harvesting all this, why didn't you take, like, the uh, shears? Or the... Sapling? I don't know. What do you want from me? Um, uh, okay, you just go do that and we'll be back. Okay. So, Pahamar, I'm having a good time. How are you doing? I'm kind of figuring out how to do this, I think. Cool. Well, I'm going to have way more bell peppers than I need. I already have way more bell peppers than I need. Uh, because they're one of the Harvest Craft ones, I just went ahead and tossed it in our Harvest Crafter. I only needed a stack, but I'm going to wind up getting, like, a lot. Uh, the other thing I needed to make for that delicious meal is a smoothie, by the way. Okay. Um, okay. Have you seen the effects of the Green Grove thingy? The yeah, sigil. You, yeah, you used it on um, some of the plants here when we were doing the lettuce. It works on watermelons and pumpkins, by the way. Oh, nice. Yeah. So I'm using it to grow a lot of pumpkins so I can make the strawberry smoothies, or the melon smoothies, cause, or, yeah, what, you know what I mean, watermelons. Yeah, there's sure. A, yeah, sure. You need to do some kind of smoothie. So there's a melon smoothie, which will work for the delighted meal, um, and that requires a melon and a snowball. We still have snow, right? Yeah, we still have snow. All right, cool. And I also tossed some pigs into our spawn room over there. Yeah, the sigil of the green grove is great for watermelons, because even though they don't respond to bone meal, <laughs> it does a really nice job. I guess our things are off here, but that's okay. I'll just go collect all this stuff. Ugh, bees are hard enough. Why am I doing trees? You wanted to, dude. I'm just saying. I felt like it was something that would have appeased her. But I'm not appeasing her. I'm just getting frustrated. No, you're angering her. You're making the jaded one mad. And you really don't want to do that. Like, I've seen what happens. It's it's not a good time for anybody. How am I for pork chop? Oh, I have plenty of pork chops. That's good. We can turn that off now. All right, so I think I've now got pretty much everything. I'm just going to do a little bit of crafting. You want to come back after I've crafted stuff? Sure. Sure. Okay. Okay. 
All right, Pahamara, I think I'm ready here. You're ready for the... Wow, I completely broke English there. Yeah, you did. Uh, so let's see. Check. All it was was crafting, so I just taught the A system how to craft it. And a delightful meal. So unless there's more to this that comes after this, I think we're good to go. Uh, so let's see. This is the end, and it's Five Star Chef, and it's a crafting task. Oh. Yeah, you need, yeah, to, you do you it. need to do it. That's not cool. I crafted it. <laughs> it's there. <laughs> I actually have to do the crafting, don't I? Not yep. a manual submit yep. quest, is it? Uh -huh. That's painful. Oh. Okay, I guess we'll be back when I'm done. <laughs> okay, Padmara, I'm crafting this time. That better count. <laughs> uh, and now I have to make some supreme pizzas. Uh, Don't screw it up. I might have screwed it up. I think we're out of onions and spice leaves. No, we're out of onions. We have plenty of spice leaves. We have plenty of bell pepper. Onions, not so much, but I can make that very quickly. I think. Here goes nothing. So well, I've been experimenting. Uh, All right, onions are in progress. I think Let's go I ahead. have a better idea what I need to do for trees now. Oh? Well, I realize that just like bees, there's handy NEI tooltips for how to get certain trees. Correct. So I'm reading the quest log. Sorry, I'm just gathering up flowers here because I need to make space to plant some trees. Have you not done any tree breeding yet? Never. I've never done tree breeding. Oh, well, basically what you need to do is you have to put some some beehives near two trees, and they'll breed together. Yeah, I, I realize that. It was like okay. ha trying to figure out how to get the particular breed I wanted and as well, because uh, gentistry has certainly made my life a lot easier. How do you use right. it? So just a sec. I almost have all these flowers oh. gone. So it also read from the change log, uh, from the change log, the quest book, that uh, jaded bees are particularly effective at um, getting trees to breed together. Okay. So let me just deposit these things. I've... Okay. Okay. <laughs> I have to. <laughs> What'd you All do? Right, hold what on. Do? I'm almost there. I'm almost there. <laughs> So if I, I were to I look at how to get a banana pepper. sapling, I need a balsa sapling and jungle pollen. A balsa Fun. sapling balsa is sapling. teak sapling with silver lime pollen. So a uh, teak sapling is made from silver lime saplings and jungle pollen. Silver lime saplings made from silver birch sapling and apple oak pollen. So I can get the the family tree, so to speak, of what I need to breed in terms of getting the saplings I want. So I need to start okay. with birch. I apparently need to get rye, barley. Luckily, I have one of each of those. There's another quest, by the way. This one is actually a consume quest, so I don't have to actually do the crafting. White mushroom, which apparently you were growing for some reason. Yep, because I needed it for um, the yeah. mushroom bacon okay. cheeseburger. We have a banana sapling from Pam's Harvest Craft. Does that help? We no, also have banana pollen. Did you know yeah, that? Yeah, and I know yeah. about the banana pollen, but that's not going to help us either. Okay, cool. I'm guessing the one I need bananas is Pam's Harvest Craft bananas. And asparagus. Ooh. Okay. I can do most of this, I guess. Um, the bananas probably... I'm going to plant the banana sapling that we have. Is that cool with you? Go for it. I'm just going to put it over here in our little tree area and hopefully... Well, actually, I probably don't want to plant it here because I'm afraid our harvester from Mine Factory Reloaded will eat it up. So you know what I'll do? I'll plant it over here. Yeah, that's a plan. 
Do I still have an axe of the stream somewhere? I have many axes. None of them are of the stream. Is it in our tools chest? No, we used it up. We did! Well, that was foolish of us. Back when we, we were don't trying have, to like, get the amaranth. We don't have, like, an awesome chop-down-many-trees axe, do we? Use the Spiked Invar axe. one. Does that one chop down, like, the whole tree at once? Yep. Yep. Really? Yep. Just Invar? Or... Uh, sorry, the uh, sorry. Flux one. Oh, okay, cool. I'm gonna plant this over here. Alright, if I've done this properly... You know, I'm gonna get rid of the rain. Okay. Gotta say, Palmar, I like the axe of the stream better. You can make a new one if you want. You're the magic man. I know I could, just don't really feel like it. Alright, so what I'm hoping here is that these birch trees... Oh, I should plant some oak as well. Yeah. Now my question is, did I remove my... I think I did. Yeah, I did, but that's okay. I can put it back. Where did I put my ritual thingy? So now I wait, I guess. I was going to set up my whatchamacallit over here, but I don't know what happened to my master ritual stone and the ritual that I had for that. I must have used it somewhere else and completely forgot. So I'm you know what I did? Wearing... I used it for alchemy. I'm also wearing these spectacles, which apparently help show the leaves that have mutated already. Yes. Do you know the funny story behind those spectacles? Um, no. Well, it's not that funny of a story. It's just a bug that we found on Forgecraft way early on related to those. Apparently what they used to do was, like, somehow update chunks for everybody in the area, even if, like, you're not wearing them. And it was constantly flickering on and off because what it would do is it'd like turn on to show you and then it would realize you're not wearing the spectacles so turn off and then in the next tick it would turn on realize you're not wearing the spectacles and turn off so if anybody was wearing them near you it would cause severe client lag oh lovely yeah it was a good time i'm gonna make some of these territory upgrades okay I'm going to take care of this little nifty gadget that I need to do. I'm recycling. I wish I could see some tree leaves changing. I wonder if while I'm waiting for this, if I should work on some of the bragging rights quests. If you want. I'm guessing that's on now. Yeah, it's on. I'm seeing the little particles. Cool. I'm hoping that that ritual will help with the growing of things, but we'll find out. Oh, I'm hungry. No wonder I'm not running fast. <laughs> Well, I've got some good meals now. I wonder how much... Oh, that fills my health up completely. Awesome. So one of the things I needed was rye. Sure, we'll do that one first. Hopefully this works like all the others. Hey, I've got a banana tree. Look at me. What? I have a banana tree. Oh, you have the Pam's banana tree. Yeah, I don't have the your banana tree. Are you working on the McGorries? Uh, I'm doing whatever. No, I'm doing the the end quest. Ah, because McGorries uh, has got things Japanese. like um, banana nut bread. Ooh, that sounds good. I want some of that now. You can make it. I could. I've got like awesome food, by the way. Food has long ago stopped being a problem. 
I know, but this fills up your hunger in one bite. It's kind of awesome. Breathe. Do you want to come back in a few minutes, or...? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I think so. All right, because I have to do some, uh, some, some bread making and such. Sounds good. Sounds All right. Good. Cool. All right, Pahamar. I finished with the asparagus, set it up in our little bone meal slash harvest slash planter thingy. And if I'm correct, I should be able to manually submit this. And we can claim reward on Five Star Chef. Hooray! Woot woot. That's awesome. So we have a lot of green heart canisters now. <laughs> you mean I, I have, have a lot more of them. precision shears. Wow, that's hilarious. What'd you get? Anything good? In of our shears. Oh, wow. It is really interested in giving us shears. So I don't know what quests we need to do to unlock the next two end quests. I'm assuming bees and trees will unlock one, but what's going to unlock the other? I don't think it's bragging rights, is it? I think the other one is going to unlock when we've completed all these ones around it. Yeah? Yep. So I would think the middle one gets unlocked, but there's one that has like a grass block and one that has like a hoe, like a diamond hoe. And I imagine one of those is from bees and trees getting done, but maybe both are? It's possible. Uh, how's the grumpy one doing? The grumpy one is grumpy. I'm waiting for these uh -oh. trees to like do their thing. Yeah? Did you try the pollen? Yeah, pollen didn't want to work. Why not? I don't know, man. Come over here. By me. Okay, by you. Why are you no work, Pollen? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Are you trying to put are the banana, to pollen, put the banana pollen, right pollen right on? Yeah. Yeah, that won't work. It should work. Remember, this is different. No, it's not. Did you, like, put those saplings in a trealizer before you planted them? No. Should, put I, a should put, I have? Put a sapling in a trealizer and then plant it. Like, just a totally different one. Actually, toss me the sapling, too, when you've done that. There you go. Okay. All right, come over here and tell me if you can uh, I see it now. Yeah. Now you want to use your thingy there. Oh, boy, that's big time serious business. Did you get the sapling? Yep, so that was my problem. I didn't uh, trialize the saplings when I grew them. Yep. See, I tried to give you advice, and Bob I was like, I know what I'm doing, Dire Wolf. I'm, I'm the grumpy one. one. All right, I've handed right, botany yeah, and biology in. Nice. So we completed two quests. We've actually completed a lot of quests this episode. So do you want some slimy saplings, or do you want some hearts? I'm guessing slimy saplings, because... Or no, it's just you reward get both. bags. You get both. All right, so I'll do the left reward bag. I got blackberry seeds. Right seeds. All right, cool. And did I hand in... I handed in my thing, right? Bragging rights one? Yep. Yep. Or no, the end one? Cone yeah. Collection. Oh, interesting. I got magnesium dust. I could have used that a long time ago. Oh, and I need to make eight mysterious magnets of level eight. Dude, wow, that sucks. <laughs> Jaded really hates you. Yeah, this one, she uh, she definitely took some special love. Uh, and what else do you need? Some You need a whole bunch of combs and drops and stuff. Yeah, and I think yeah. I got most of the bees I need for that. Well, that's good at least. But yeah, eight mysterious magnets. Turn in eight level eight magnets. Wow. That's harmful. Like a level 8 magnet, do you know how to make those? I've seen, it's quite the long crafting chain by the look of it. Well yeah, you need two level 7s, and for a level 7 you need two level 6s, and for a level 6 you need two level 5s. I don't think I need to go on, right? Nope. <laughs> and for all of that you need a dimensional singularity, which is an eye of ender, a block of gold, a block of quartz, and some endstone. We should not be too bad on that, really. If you think about it. 
I would, I would think you're not too bad. I'll get you some endstone if you want. That would be appreciated. Yeah. I think Let's it's. See. I'll Let's look see. at the bees first because it's pretty slow actually. Uh... Let's see. Silky comb. Yeah, I'll, I'll help you out with this one because this is actually pretty nasty. Oh, silky combs is tropical. We got that. Dripping. Cool. You want to come back after we've done some crafting? Sure. Okay. All right, Pahamar, I'm working on some endstone for you because that magnet thing, I requested one mysterious magnet a while ago. We had like 200 endstone and like, I think it got like maybe halfway done and it's out of endstone. So it requires a lot <laughs> of endstone. And I'm working on um, the B side of this. Do you want to see my new way of making endstone? Just a second, cool. I'm checking my numbers here. Nine occult, 25 molten, nine soul, 26 Also, I'm silky. making you a present. 26 dripping. You are? Yeah, because I'm a nice guy. What are you making me? A present. I briefly saw something there. Yep, that was the plan. Alright, intellect drops. We already have destabilized drops and Sweet. carbon. There you go. Ah, there it goes. Good job. Tossing it right beside oh, the, uh, what the... It's plates of in some sort. Thing in the middle. All right, well, you can get, it, get it again. Here it is. What is this thing? This thing. Yeah. Take off your jetpack. Put it in your hand. Shift right click. No, the jetpack. Ah, armored resonant jetpack. Yeah, look at that, huh? The fun thing is, I still can't wear it right now. Oh, well, yeah, I know. But at least now it's got armor, so... Woohoo! Thank, well, thank you. Cool. Thank you. Check this out. I'm over at our smeltery. Just making sick. endstone. Just it's faster and more efficient than the Tinker's, uh, than the thermal expansion way. I thought this was I the way was... that it wanted us to do it. Well, you can either put sandstone in... A fluid transposer with 250 millibuckets of ender liquid, which is one endstone or one ender pearl. It's basically one ender pearl plus one sandstone equals endstone. Or if you do it this way, it's 50 millibuckets and one obsidian gets you an endstone. So for obsidian instead of uh, sandstone, you get like five times the efficiency, and it's faster too. So I dumped a bunch of ender pearls in there. We've got a lot. Uh, I put like three or four times 64 in, and that should be making us a bunch of sandstone. And so stone. slowly but surely, uh, we are getting what we need to get. So I've just gone through our inventory in the AE system to find what we have already for this B quest. Yeah. So I've already handed some in because we actually had a full stack of intellect drops from when I was getting the mm, pizza. Sauce. <laughs> well, that's the, a wholesome uh, feast. Yeah. That's better than that feast. I'm getting rid of that. I don't even need a feast. <laughs> Feasts are boring. Let I've got a wholesome piece. feast. Try it out. Supreme Pizza. It's pretty good. Well, I, I need to You were saying something about bees that I was ignoring? Yeah, you were ignoring a lot about bees. Okay, so go so on. We already so. had intellect drops actually from when I was getting combs as part of the other bee quest. So we had that. Okay. Um, and so I've got a bunch of bees out there. fly over. I have some uh, tropical bees. Oh, are these I'm bees going to kill me? They're killing you, so I'm going to assume they will also kill me. Let's see. i got soul queens producing uh, soul comb. Okay. Arcane queens producing... Uh, what much do they do? They do the occult combs. Occult. So soul combs, occult combs, dripping combs are done by majestic bees, which I got over here. Right here. And then I got some infernal bees going with molten combs, and I have tropical bees at the back doing silky combs. So I'll probably nice. have to probably set up to... my excited bees to get the destabilized drops, and then I need to figure out what makes carbon drops. Carbon bees. Wow. 
I'm not kidding either. <laughs> I know, but now I need to see Spiteful and Stanum. Okay, so I'm going to need to... Oh, Industrious and Forest Drone. I got that. So you want to work on breeding between this episode and next, and I'll work on uh, Endstone between this episode and next, and hopefully between the two of us we'll manage to finish up the uh, bee quests. Sounds good. I thought you might like that. You know what? We really don't have much we left. We don't. We keep saying that, but then new things show up. It happens. It's what happens when you do crazy things. It's what happens when you hang out with a certain direwolf. What? You blaming me now? So the lightning's gonna start up again. Oh, because you're doing lightning bees? Yep. I just saw lightning too, and I'm like, why is it lightning? <laughs> What do you have a tree out there for? Why is there a giant tree with my I was on it? I was testing things. Pay no attention to the attention. tree that failed. The tree with mobs on it. Look, I don't need no sass. <laughs> then you should not be doing a let's play series with me, sir. Let's see how That's pretty I, much all I, you're going to get. I had a whole bunch of destabilized combs, so let's see what I got for drops. Sweet. I think, though, we have to wrap up. No. Sorry, no. dude. It's the rules. It's the rules. You're a rule. Do I rule? Thank you. Oh, electric <laughs> oh. I like how you just said I rule. Destabilized. Oh, I'm actually going to do some breeding for this. Hmm. Destabilized yeah, do a lot of breeding for that. spiteful and industrial. Yep, I'm going to do some breeding for that because I don't have spiteful bees. Gotcha. All right, dude. I'm I'm considering upgrading our mob spawner to a cursed earth mob spawner. You might want to do that because you keep complaining about it. Dude, it's slow. What is oh up with the slowness? Oh my god! First world direwolf problems. It's slow. I think I'm gonna like do that now. I had a wand of equal trade, didn't I? Pretty sure I made one of those on this map. Yeah, I got one. Oh wow, missing materials, block of gold. Interesting. I'm guessing... Hmm. Just trying to find a nice easy way to get blocks of gold directly. Oh, an induction smelter gives you gold of war. Okay. I see how that goes. Getting there. Yeah. I guess what I'll do... I guess I'll just toss this into the pulverizer for now. I can't believe we're actually low on gold. <laughs> I mean, not really low, but like, you know what I mean. Yeah, down with the tropical bees. Nice. That'll so yeah, it was, reduce the risk of getting stung. That's cool. We should one day do something about stuff. But for now, I'm going to go do something about other stuff. You are so specific. Thank you. All right, I'm going to replace the cobblestone that's in here with cursed earth. You come with that? Go for it. I like how we say we're going to wrap up an episode and then you begin a new project. All I'm going to be doing is wand of equal trading cobblestone into dirt. I kind of feel like nobody's going to be upset if they miss that. Stop shooting me! Stop being in the line of fire! I'm trying to help you! I'm helping, says Bahamar as he doesn't. You're blocking the way in. Well, that's kind of the plan. There, was that so bad? Yes. He's the most ungrateful. I'm about to get grumpy. Bahamar is always grumpy. Probably because I'm 30. Yeah, that happens, doesn't it? 
Oh, bees still stinging. How are they? Bees are hurting. All right, I got one piece done. Cursed Earth spreads like grass, by the way. I don't know if you knew that. Neat. Yeah, so you don't really need to go too crazy with it. You just place a couple of them in here, and they'll eventually spread out, and it'll be a room full of cursed earth. As long as it's Provided dark, sunlight right? doesn't hit it. What's that? As long as it's dark on top of the block, right? Uh, yes. If sunlight hits it, it'll burn up. So we want to probably avoid coming in here if we can. But yeah, other than that, should be pretty cool. Good deal. All right. So are we wrapping up now or what? Let's wrap up. Okay. So for now, Darwell 20, Bahamar, wrapping up the episode, doing that thing that we do when it's time to wrap up. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed checking this out. We've got uh, a couple more quests to do, Bahamar, and then we're getting pretty darn close to being all kinds of done. Yeah, we might have to wrap it up, like, for good. Hopefully not too soon. Because I'm having fun on this map. It's a very fun map. Mm-hmm. And I hear there's a version 3 out already, so... It's very, I know. very good. Oh, by the way... Oh, is um, it different? Is it that different? Yeah, they've got a bunch more quests. There's a bunch more blood magic, is what I heard. Oh, yeah? Yeah. And uh, my viewers just saw I did uh, upgrade the Mutatron to an advanced Mutatron, which allows you which to allows control you. the species you get out of it. Oh, wow, really? That's crazy. Ah, there's creepers. Yep. Yeah. I All just right. love you doing stuff, stuff and hearing stuff. explosions. Well, like I said, creepers. These things should not surprise the Pahamar by now. All right, guys, we're signing off. Time to go. Hope you enjoyed it. Yada, yada. Take it easy. See you guys.